Hello and welcome to another AIC production video. Just doing another update on my 2003 and a half Mazda Speed Protege. First things first, got parts. So I've obviously have had these pipes for a while, but I got my clutch in and I talked to the guy I'm gonna have doing it for me. And he said that he will install these. I also have uh, some motor mounts that I got and transmission mounts that I got uh, when I first got the car and I did the one because it was just trash but the other ones also still need to be done He's also going to go ahead and do the sway bar uh, mounts as well or bushings because I mean a lot of this stuff is Either very accessible while he's has a transmission out to do the clutch anyways Or you have to, to take it out anyways. I mean you're, you're right there doing the work So he's going to install these parts for me. This is the sign I have for when I go to car shows, just some information about the car, a link to my YouTube channel with a QR code. If anybody wants to spiff this up for me, let me know and uh, I'll send you the file I have. Uh, it's just a Word document. Then I got my first stickers for my uh, project here. These just happen to be the first ones I showed up and they are tiny. They're so small. Um, there's a few of them in there, but they're not going to cover very much. So hopefully the Pokemon and Ghibli. I also got some Romna stickers. So I got some other stickers coming in. Hopefully they're bigger. <laughs> and they'll be enough to actually cover the fender. Because I think with this many stickers, I might be able to cover like this much of the fender. Like nothing. And then we go to the front. I realized I never did an update on the stereo. Now, I did do a short update, posted it online, and it immediately got copyright striked, even though I was trying to play music that uh, didn't matter. Uh, but this is how it looks. Let's see this. Can I get any better light in here? Sorry, this is the best light I can do because it is nighttime. But I think it turned out really, really well. I think it looks good. Uh, you can change the color here and of the background. Um, it's not as configurable as the one in my truck. Because uh, this is a lower end unit. This was only like 160, 170 bucks versus um, like 300 for the one I put in my truck. But I just didn't need that expensive of a radio in here. You do have the microphone up here. It does a really good job of... Sorry, <laughs> my light. Uh, a really good job of picking up my voice when I'm driving. Not that I make a ton of phone calls in the car, but if, when the few times I've had to as I've coordinated going to like car shows with my wife, because obviously not all of us fit in this car. We take two cars so she can leave early if she needs to with the kids. I did try to do some playback, music playback on here, but it was really hard to hear because you don't get any of the any of the bass. But let's see if I get uh, a DMC from this. Hopefully not. <laughs> this is the uh, Twisted Team Evo. Uh, this was the song that's been featured a lot on the Mighty Car Mods uh, videos recently. But I think it has a nice punch to it. I need to take that rear parcel shelf out and get it to not vibrate because that's what's vibrating is that rear parcel shelf if you can hear the vibration. So, and that, as long as I don't have it too ridiculously loud. But anyways. So yeah that's that. <laughs> I love it. I think it sounds great without being like overly like kill you off with bass. Um, it just really has a nice sound to it. So anyways that's a quick update. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comment section down below. Oh, also, you probably saw it when I first started. Oh, let's go back to the trunk. So, my amp is here. The wiring is ugly. I just have the zip tied in the place right now. I have no idea where I should have it. This speaker cable is too short for it being here. My hope was that I was going to put it up here, but there is no space for it here. So... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I really don't know what I'm going to do with the uh, the amp. So if you have any suggestions, um, or if you've put an amp in in the trunk of your um, Protégé, let me know and send me a picture or something or link to a picture 
to show me what you've done with it. I was thinking maybe taking advantage of this and that and putting something across, but then the speakers themselves are in the way of that. So not sure what to do. Anyways, yeah, let me know what you've done, uh, what your suggestions are, and I'm happy to, uh, to take those. Anyways, if you have any questions, comments, thoughts, opinions, anything like that, let me know. Uh, happy to take any constructive criticism uh, with a grain of salt. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you have an amazing day.